back today guys to the channel back here today double uploading we had the crew motor fest end of year one and season four reveal video drop this was three minutes and 30 seconds long they actually teased this on twitter Are you doing anything tonight season four and they teased it with this right and at first i didn't really think much of it after seeing a quick snippet of the trailer, I know exactly what it's about, right? This is super cool. I'm very excited for season four here on the Crew Motor Fest. And uh, we're going to dive right into this. Three minutes and 30 seconds long on this. And it's 4K. Ubisoft, thank you. Huge thanks for watching for today. And of course, don't forget to slap that like button. Here we go. The Crew Motor Fest. End of the year already? Wait, wait, what? How? This year has been flying by. They've dropped so many good DLCs. I've just been getting back into it recently as well, too. But there's still a lot of content I have yet to Hi do Hi, everyone. Here. I'm really happy to be here with you today. After the release of three seasons, time has right? come to share with you a quick update about our next one. Season four yeah. will be your next oh, stop at Motorfest. The the big... And trust me, your customization skills will have to reach new heights as we kick off a brand new playlist. Welcome to the Dark world first of Dawn low rider. versus no low rider. Way. This is gonna be good. I'm hey, hoping for something. They almost like a dunks. midnight club. A donk is all about self-expression, a way of showing your individuality. No way. Building a low rider, it goes beyond the cars. It's a lifestyle. The a three wheeling. Oh, this is so sick. This reminds me of GTA all no over again. No other customization community has influenced the modern. That actually looks like my car that I built. I did the whole GTA 5 montage trailer with it. Ain't no way. This is gonna be sick. Muscle car city out here. This is exactly That's what we've been hoping for. The West Coast. Oh man, the crew. It's all about Thank style you. And power. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Your dog is gonna kill the game. I'm excited for this. All eyes on us. Get into the rhythm. Andale. <laughs> Girl got hard. We're gonna have like mini games with these two? It's a dog versus lowrider playlist we talking about. Choose your side and choose wisely. Ooh, I don't know, donk or lowrider? I'm probably gonna have to go lowrider, I think. But these donks, so look at the I'm probably gonna go donk. Full drag strip too? Yeah, I think I'm going donk for sure. Season 4 and this new playlist will be available for free to all players on July 3rd. And that's not July the 3rd? only good news I have in store for you today. That's next month! I'm so yeah. happy to announce that Haba, Lancia, like and Alfa Romeo yeah, no will arrive way. in the True Motorfest on June 13th. Oh, I'm so upset. Okay, well, at least we have something to look forward to. Get back on the swing of things here. We have to uh, pick uh, the crew motor fest back up on the channel. Complete some of those events that we have left to do. You may do some have online. Seen some of them in the crew two already. Of course, those will be now eligible for the collection in board. And monster minis out here, monster man. Fiat, holy! But that's not all. To properly celebrate this announcement, the mesmerizing Alfa Romeo Sadale will be available as a Twitch drop reward during Ubisoft for while. Yes, the Crew Motor Fest will be present at the conference, and we have big announcements to make there about year two. That's exciting. So stay tuned and see you then. July 3rd, though. God damn. Crew Motor Fest now also to... Oh, shit. Didn't mean to click that, but hey. We landed on the Crew Motor Fest page. Uh, if you guys didn't see that dude in blue, David Patterson, right? He is also in the Crew Motor Fest. I want to watch that trailer quickly because uh, shout out to David. All right, David Patterson. There he is right and here. Okay. The Motor Fest Walk of Fame. Um, so it's him Welcome and back. Shmi getting added in to the Crew Motor Fest. I'm personally Team David myself. Huge fan of him. To the main stage and the Motor Fest. The man Walk made it into the main this stage. Month, that dude in blue meets Shmi 150. Shout out to Bo Shmi here. and David. Motorfest made the call and I'm taking it on. Hi guys, I'm Shmi and I'm delighted to oh, be invited yeah. by Motorfest to showcase some of the wonderful cars from my collection. This is cool. Speed, luxury, customization. It's whatever our guest creators decide. It feels very natural as well to all these cutscenes that they're using. So I'm going to go customize some cars and see how far we can really push these babies. Oh, they're all blue, man. That's so sick. 
Have a thing for drifting in JDM cars? That's me. You've come to the right place. It's my pleasure to invite you all to join us on the main yeah, stage. Yeah, he's going to have some supercars for sure. The Museum uh -huh. are the perfect complement to the Motorfest, and we're going to be getting David's perspective as a bonus. I can't wait to see what's in store. Very Thanks for cool. joining us. I love soon. what they're doing with this. Having two content creators in here. It's been super cool to see them. I was team Black Panther last time. I'm now team that dude in blue this time. Uh, playback speed to 0.5. It was super cool to see them post and this today. I've been still waiting for the update the with David to drop. I don't know when that is. They haven't really set a date credits. on there. Hopefully Welcome not next month as well, but also that that whole ride. bike scene going through the trucks. What is that? Where can I find hey, that? Right? I'm definitely going to try that. I still don't know what I'm going to do, though. Am I going to be a donk or lowrider? I feel like I feel like I'm going to go donk, though. It's going to be nice, though. we got a couple of Impalas. Holy Regal. Look at the bike back there. People just sitting by their houses, too. That's how we go. What is that back there? It's like a cornet almost. Charger, maybe I can't really tell. It's all about it looks sick though, yeah. It's got to be like a Barracuda or something. What is that back there? That black one right there. See, this right here is kind of getting me intrigued. The fact that they are kind of just hanging around here. Oh, these are the R.I.P. damn pop-up headlights. Don't a media shirt. That's that's actually kind of cool. But yeah, the fact that this is almost like a little story cutscene almost. I'm liking this, and the, it kind of ties in the little Pit My Ride that I've been just playing on the PS2 as well. I don't know if you guys have been watching that playthrough, but uh, I'm going to probably be posting a part two. That's a Roadrunner. I thought I saw a Roadrunner back there, but I can't I, I can't tell exactly if these are already in the game, though. So if you guys have been playing this for a bit, I'm pretty sure the Roadrunner was in the game already. But we got the Impala back there. All eyes on us. Very cool with what they're doing though. Big old caddy coming in. Is that a Cadillac? What is that? It's a dog versus no ride. Oh yeah. Choose your side. So we got a little customization options. Oh yeah. 454 big block. Caprice. Yeah, I thought it was a Caprice classic. No way. Max upgrades. I like how they have the little uh shop there to upgrade the car. But they picked two really good setups here. I don't know. That shows me, though. Let me know your thoughts down below. I love low riders. I love donks. I love old school muscle cars. So this is a perfect update for me. Right? I think this is really cool. And the fact that they just, right, you got the wheel customization. I wonder how big you can go. Right? Can we go Midnight Club status? Go like what? Like 30s? No, I think the, the maximum wheel on Midnight Club was a 29, if I'm not mistaken. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section, maybe even 28, right? But I feel like if we can implement what Need for Speed did over here, um, I think that would make the drifting a lot more fun on this game than it is currently. Because at the moment when you are doing the activities, um, they are very similar to each other, right? So I'm hoping that some of the new ones are gonna be cool, they're gonna be different and unique from what we've played, and maybe even implement a couple other cars, whether they be AI cars or whatever, right? Just something other than drifting by yourself on the game that's all i'm saying right huge thanks for watching they do have wheel setups back there actually did you see that so that means that they've been playing this on the wheel as well is that what's going on back there crew motorfest on the wheel they got the full dd1 setup look at we also got that over there um but the crew motorfest with the dd1 holy jeez man you have to plug in the wheel and see how it does play on the dd1 huge thanks for watching for today let me know your thoughts and i'll see you guys back here tomorrow i'm out peace